Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Formative's new AI feature to quickly generate practice assessments and quizzes on just about any topic. Let's go ahead and take a look at how it works. So I'm here at formative.com and the first thing you need to do is obviously sign into your account and here I am in my account and in order to get access to the AI tool you need to go into your account settings and you can find those down there in your account button and click on your account and select settings and then down at the bottom here you'll find this option for early access and you'll want to make sure you've turned on AI content creation and you can turn on formative student practice as well, but you don't have to in order to use the AI tool. You just need to turn on the AI content creation. Then go back up to formatives and at the top right corner, select add and you want to select AI generate formative and let's do a trivia let's say ninth grade and I want to do something about United States landmarks let's go ahead and generate the formative and we'll see here it's going to tell us that it's being generated and you can wait for the notification or you can watch it in real time by clicking on view formative and we'll see on this screen here hang on it's still hard at work and it'll take a few minutes and in my earlier practice it did only take a few minutes to generate a practice quiz for me to share with my students Let's go ahead and take a look at that right now. So we'll see here, it's now created this trivia game for me. Now I'm going to edit the title up here. I'll leave out the AI generated part and make sure it actually says landmarks and not landmark. And now we can go down here and we'll see the correct answers. We can go in and change the point values if we want to, the default is just one point but i would change it to 10 points and i can make this required and i can use all the other formative features that i would typically use if i had manually created the assignment including let's say i don't want to use one of the questions let's go ahead and just delete that question and it will remove it from my list of questions and now I can just assign it like I would any other formative assessment and if you've never used formative before I have some more tutorials about it linked up right down below so that's how you can use formatives new AI formative creation tool as always for more things like this please visit freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.